Hello everyone and welcome back. We have made it to the final of Portal 2. Just need to get up here and we will be in Wheatley's lair. Core transfer, that's the way to do it. So let's call that three minutes and then a minute break where we should leave allegedly two minutes to figure out how to shut down whatever is starting all the fires. So anyway, that's the itinerary. Also, I took the liberty of watching the tapes of you killing her and I'm not going to make the same mistakes. Four part plan is this. One, no portal services. Two, start the neurotoxin immediately. Three, bomb proof shields for me. Needing direct bills number four, four. I'm throwing it. You know what? This plan is so good, I'm going to give you a sporting chance and turn off the neurotoxin. I'm joking, of course. Good luck. Neurotoxin level at capacity in five minutes. Where are you going? Don't run! Don't run! I'll tell you why you should run. The harder you breathe, the more neurotoxin you'll inhale. It's bloody clever. It's sheer devilish. Don't run! Don't run! Now I've got ah, portal surfaces. That sounded real. No, that was actually an impression of you. Actually, because you just fell into my trap, my brilliant trap. Just then, I wanted you to trick. Ah! Okay. Catwalk. What catwalk? I don't see any catwalk. Still don't see a catwalk. Oh, that catwalk. Ah. I gotta jump on this expansion gel. There we go. Alright, one down, two to go. Reactor explosion in four minutes. What happened? What happened? What 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 do you what do you to me? What is that? Hold on! Ah, the bloody bombs are stuck on! Doesn't matter! I've reconfigured the shield! Oh, it's a core you pawned me! Who told you to do that? Was it her? It's just making me stronger, love! It's a fool's errand! Remember when I first told you how to find that little portal thing you love so much? Well, I thought you'd die on the way, if I'm honest. All the others... Oh, gonna have to do that again. Note to self, do not get hit with the bombs. Reactor explosion in uh, four minutes. What, what okay. What At least they left the core on them. I can pretty much start where I just left off. Ah, the bloody bombs are stuck on. Doesn't matter. I've reconfigured the shield. Oh, it's a core you pawned me. Who told you to do that? Was it her? It's just making me stronger, love. It's a fool's errand. Remember when I first told you how to find that little portal thing you love so much? Well, I thought you'd die on the way, if I'm honest. All the others did. You didn't think you were the first, did you? Ha ha ha! No, no, no! Fifth! No, I like six. Perhaps it's best to leave it to your imagination what happens to the other five. Do you know what? I think we're well past the point of tasteful restraint, so I'll tell you what happened to them. They died. 
horrifically. They all die horrifically. Trying to get to that portal device that you're gripping in your meaty little fingers there. Oh, ah! Okay, where's the second core? Great, what's the situation? What, are you fighting that guy? You got that under control? You know, because well, there's a lot of stuff on fire. Wait, the countdown clock. Man, that is trouble. Situation's looking pretty up. Such a beautiful woman. If you don't mind me saying. I don't want to scare you. I'm an adventure sphere. Designed for danger. Why don't you go ahead and have yourself a little lady break, and I'll just take it from here. Here, stand behind me. Yeah, just like that. Just like you're doing. Warning. Core corruption at seven. Two down, one to go. Reactor explosion timer destroyed. Reactor explosion uncertainty emergency preemption protocol initiated. This facility will self destruct in two minutes. Enough! I told you not to put these cores on, but you don't listen, do you? Quiet. All the time. Quietly, not listening to a word I say, judging. The sign of worse kind. All I wanted to do was make everything better for me. All you had to do was to solve a couple of hundred simple tests for a few years, and you couldn't even let me have that, could you? Gotta go to space. Yeah, gotta go to space. Nobody's going to space, mate! And another thing, you never caught me, but that! Ah! I don't see it. Oh, there it is, way up there. What the heck? Oh, momentum. I'm gonna need momentum to grab this one. Alright, where's he at? There he is. Almost got him the first time. William Shakespeare did not exist. His plays were masterminded in 1589 by Francis Bacon, who used a Ouija board to enslave playwriting ghosts. According to most advanced algorithms, the world's best name is Craig. Edmund Hillary, the first person to climb Mount Everest, did so accidentally while chasing a bird. It is incorrectly noted that Thomas Edison invented push-ups in 1878. Nikolai Tesla had in fact patented the activity three years earlier under the name Tesla Size. Gentle Floss has superb tensile strength. Warning. Core corruption at 100%. Ah! Manual core replacement required. Oh, I see. <laughs> Substitute core. Are you ready to start? Corrupted core. Are you ready to start? What do you think? Interpreting vague answer as yes. No, 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 no. Didn't pick up on my sarcasm. Stalemate detected. Uh-oh. Not a stalemate. stalemate. Resolution annex. Extinguishing. I gotta push the red button no, somewhere. Right off, does it? Well, that would have been good to know a little earlier. Stalemate resolution associate, please press the stalemate resolution button. Do not press that button. No! Do not do it. I forbid you to press it. Don't press that button. Don't press it. Come back. No! Do not press that button. Do not do it. Can't press the button. I can't even get in there. There. Oh. Blew me up. Are you still alive? You are joking. You have got to be kidding me. But I'm still in control, and I have no idea how to fix this place. Oh, you had to play bloody cat and mouse, didn't you? What? Ooh, we shot the moon. Remember, the white gel is made out of moon dust. So now there's a portal in the lair and a portal on the moon. Right here. And there's all the stuff that the astronauts left when they faked the moon landing back in 1969 on a Hollywood soundstage. No! Wheatley's not such a bad guy when he's not in charge. Oh, thank God. 
Hey, those are the two robots from the co-op. If you play two-player, those are the robots that you use. The surge of emotion that shot through me when I saved your life taught me an even more valuable lesson. Where Carolyn lives in my brain. Carolyn, delete. Goodbye, Carolyn. You know, deleting Carolyn just now taught me a valuable lesson. The best solution to a problem is usually the easiest one. And I'll be honest, killing you is hard. You know what my days used to be like? I just tested. Nobody murdered me, or put me in a potato, or fed me to birds. I had a pretty good life. And then you showed up, you dangerous, mute, lunatic. So you know what? You win. Just go. <laughs> it's been fun. Don't come back. Now I'm free to walk through a wheat field. With my companion cube. The end. We'll watch the credits because people took a lot of time to make this game. And it is awesome.
damage space. Need to see it all. <laughs> I wish I could take it all back. I honestly do. I honestly do wish I could take it all back. And not just because I'm stranded in space. I'm in space. I know you are, mate. Yeah, we're both in space. space. Anyway, you know, if I was ever to see her again, do you know what I'd say? I'm in space. I'd say, I'm sorry. Sincerely. Come on, I'm Wheatley. Sorry I was bossy. You gotta have some kind of Monsters. propulsion where you can get back to Earth. And I am genuinely sorry. I don't know. I'm in space. Anyways, that's the end of the game, folks. Thank you for watching this series. I will see you next time. You take care. Bye-bye.